Welcome back, everybody. Hello. Look who I brought. Hi. It is Queen Boomer. I am back. Yes. Okay. Um, we haven't... Did you do a reaction video with me with uh, Sarah Milliken before? Yeah. I can't remember. Okay. Um, I forgot what she was talking about. But yeah, I liked her. She's really funny. Okay. Well, this is Sarah Milliken. Men versus women. How appropriate okay. since I got you back on camera. Ready for it. So this should be pretty good. Um, I'm very excited. Let me uh, make sure. Okay. She's married to that one guy, right? Yeah, Gary Delaney? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. So this should be good. Let's get right into it. Here we go. But what we do with audiences is asking the ladies what's the best thing about being a woman and the men what's the best thing about being a man and then working out whether I'm more male or more female depending on you guys tonight. And obviously it changes every night and it's fun for you but it's ever so slightly terrifying for me. So let's get cracking on that. I'm going to write them down because I've got such an awful memory. Let's get some ladies shouting out. What do we think is the best thing about... Fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> Always being right. Where are you, love? Oh, there you are. Always being right. Wow. Are you in a relationship at the minute? <laughs> You are? Is your partner with you tonight? Are you all right, love? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Always being right is a good answer. And we need a couple more from the ladies. Best thing about being a woman? Free dinners. Free dinners? <laughs> Where are you? Free dinners. Okay. <laughs> Who pays for the actual dinners? The fella. Okay. <laughs> They're not really free, though, are they, love? Who's that? The little pleasing couple from the background. Did you see that? Yeah. She's like, not really free. At least she gets. Aww. That pizza's worth it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Wow. And uh, one more for the ladies. Best thing about being a woman? Nothing. Nothing. Oh. Did you just shout out nothing? <laughs> Nobody's ever said that before. <laughs> what, why don't you like being a... Are you like... like are you due a big operation soon or... <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. I've had enough. <laughs> I'm going to get a cock. <laughs> Would you rather be a man? Oh, you're not really sure? So you're not... Okay, I'm just going to put indecisive down for you. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that fella will buy you a dinner. <laughs> then you would change your mind. <laughs> wow, shallow as well. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get some ladies shouting out. What do you think the best thing is about being a woman? Tits. <laughs> just tits. Tits. Lady. <laughs> How long have you had them? <laughs> Quite a while. I got mine when I left school. I, d I mean, that, that's when they grew. What? I know my favorite thing about being a woman. What is it? Not having to wear pants. Not having to wear pants? Yeah. Like today. What do you mean? <laughs> Like that I can wear that I can wear dresses and it's like socially acceptable. Oh, okay. Like today I didn't want to pick out an outfit and I was like, a dress. Single color. Dress. You're gonna tell all my followers that they, like my girlfriend doesn't wear pants ever. Well I mean, if you wanna wear a dress you can, but I like that I don't have to wear pants. Okay. So I don't mean like you've done quite well in your GCSEs. Have some tits. <laughs> This is a good answer. Thank you very much, lady. And there was another lady shouted out, but I didn't... Are you upstairs or downstairs? The lady who shouted out something... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, love. We're better at everything. <laughs> I love that one woman went, yeah! And the rest of you went, oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna kick off now. <laughs> better at everything. Everything. Okay. Uh, do any of the fellas want to shout out something that they think they may be better than that lady at? Pissing through letterboxes. Pissing through letterboxes. We've got shoeies. We can fucking do that now. 
<laughs> Maybe you are right, lady. Well done. <laughs> and we need one more from the lady's best thing about being a woman? Being psychic. Are you psychic? No. No? No, not at all. Okay, just check. <laughs> Okay, are you trained? <laughs> no. Are you in a relationship? Do you really think so? Here, here. In here. this relationship, yes, yes. I am more patient. Yes, I am. If very I lose patient. a video game, I'm like, oh no, I'll try something different next time. You're like, I have lost the game. <laughs> yeah. Well, for those of you who've seen the live streams, yes. She's yeah. ab absolutely right. Moment. Yes. Is this. It's, oh, lovely, lovely, hello, lovely lady. Tell me, is your lovely lady psychic? No, she's not, is she? It's because it's not real, is it? <laughs> the reason she's not is because it's not possible. <laughs> uh, what do you think I'm thinking now about you? <laughs> that you've what? Go with that to make her feel better about herself. <laughs> but I've got nice glasses. That's brilliant. You know that you're alone is what I was thinking. But <laughs> whatever. Okay, let's get some fellas. Uh, nice fella here. You're quite young. How old are you? I'm 23. 23. What do you think is the best thing about being a man, love? Um, Saturday football. Saturday football. Do you play football or is it watching? Watch. Watching. Is it going to kick off if you say who you support? Will it kick off? No. What's your favorite thing about being a man? Dating you. Stop. No. <laughs> that was very cute. Should we? Are we ready? <laughs> Who do you support, love? I'm an Arsenal fan. <laughs> Wait, what do you say? No, it's, it should be right. Should we? Are we ready? <laughs> Who do you support, love? I'm an Arsenal fan. <laughs> 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 the best, I've had this answer before when I said to this fella, he said football, and I said, will it kick off? And he said, uh, oh, I don't know, and it was really exciting, and the whole room was dead tense, and it was in Liverpool, the sort of place where it might well divide opinion. And he went, Hull, and everybody in the room went, who? <laughs> Watching football is a good answer, thank you very much, love. Let's get some more fellas. The, the fella who shouted out about uh, pissing through letterboxes, is that your answer? What? <laughs> <laughs> the best thing about being a man, that's it, done. <laughs> Pacing through letterboxes. <laughs> I've got a shiwi now, I'm definitely going to have a go at that. Uh, it Do you know what a shiwi is? No. So, one of the good things about being a man is you guys can pee outside. So, a shiwi, I only know this because I woke up at like 3 a.m. one day and there was a commercial for it. It's like a thing that you can put underneath a woman's part so that you can pee like a guy. Really? Yeah, and that's what a shiwi is. Interesting. Yeah. I mean, Interesting. A bloke said uh, the best thing about being a man was peeing standing up. And I said to him, oh, where's the weirdest place you've had a wee? And I was doing this and he went, uh, in a water bottle on a stage once. <laughs> <laughs> on a stage? A very thirsty little bit champion. So thank you very much, fella. Let's get some more fella shout now. Best thing about being a bloke? You there, fella? What did you, oh somebody say not being was it you not being a woman? What do you think you'd hate about being a woman? Not being able to weigh in the side of the road. <laughs> yes, you just take things that have been said before and pass them off as your road look. <laughs> <laughs> what would you hate about being a woman? Being not being right. <laughs> <laughs> a nice answer to like a rally hasn't it <laughs> bless him she's yeah she's she's just doing that I'm sorry face I'm sorry i have this all the time he's a dick i cannot help it <laughs> well done lady for putting up with that shite <laughs> you've taken them off the street so we don't have to go out with them well done <laughs> wait another fella shout out but i didn't quite hear it that's the best thing about being a man. 
one at a time. <laughs> like, do you want that whole pack of biscuits? I'm happy with one biscuit. I'll come back to you in about half an hour and I'll try for another biscuit. <laughs> His wife's gone, ah, ah, ah. It's fine, I can feed myself, love. <laughs> Never made a parallel between orgasms and biscuits, but I like it. <laughs> Thank you very much. Let's get some fellas shout now. Best thing about being a bloke? Not having a vagina. Not having a vagina. <laughs> <laughs> that. Some of the men are disagreeing. <laughs> That's what made it really fun to me. You the guys were like, all the guys like turned like, yeah. <laughs> Not having a vagina. <laughs> I think some of the men are disagreeing with you. <laughs> Which is quite an odd turn of events. Not having a vagina. I feel you're so against vaginas, sir. I feel like, you know, somebody should rub one in your face before the end of the show. <laughs> It's not going to be me, fuck off. I've got niggas on that go up to me bra, it would take too long. When was the last time you saw one? Like on the way out? Yeah. Was it on the way out? Maybe for about 14. That was when you were born? No. That was when you last looked at one? Okay. You've seen them on TV. Sort of seek them out on telly, don't you? <laughs> I don't think he just pops up in the middle of like crime watch. <laughs> like how she thought that out. Like, yeah. <laughs> you know, I don't think they just appear. They don't just appear. Out. You gotta seek them out. <laughs> as far as I'm aware, you have to sort of seek them out on telly, don't you? Oh, I don't great. think he just pops up in the middle of like crime watch. <laughs> Maybe it does. You've seen them on TV, and is your reaction much like whenever I do a joke about vaginas and you do that, oh, is it the same then? But do you know the noise that you do whenever you see a cock? There's no noise, you just, you got so excited, no noise came out. It was almost an intake of breath, wasn't it? Rather than a noise, like a, like that. Like when I see a big cake and nobody around. <laughs> Not having a vagina. Thank you very much. Let's get two more fellas shouting out. Best thing about being a bloke? Reverse parking. Who, who said that? Oh. You said reverse parking. I think he did, yeah. <laughs> Calm down. Calm down. That. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. I think I tried once and I hit a mailbox. That one really hit you. <laughs> oh, my poor baby. I agree. I wish I could do that. Oh, man. Oh. Let's get two more fellas shouting out. Best thing about being a bloke? Reverse parking. Who, who said that? It's like three men clapping. Reverse parking. <laughs> Reverse parking. Let's test him. Should we test him? This is a lady different. Yes, test him. <laughs> test him. <laughs> Reverse park. And how long have you been driving, love? Uh, 30 years. 30 years. It was easier then. There wasn't just like horses and carts and that. <laughs> <laughs> and can you, let's test him. Uh, can you, can you reverse like in first time? Mostly, yes. Mostly. Oh, at least he's honest. Mostly. Uh, and can you, uh, let's have a think, what else? Can you, can you reverse round the corner? Yes. Oh. <laughs> have you got any points on your license? No. Get you. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> the woman said a four. The woman said a four. That's classic. That's classic. Relationships stand for fuck all when it's men against women. Have you noticed? <laughs> yes, he has. <laughs> Now. What did you say, love? Three points for speeding well, rushing to help an old lady. 
Oh, oh, I'm Russian to have the old lady. You could have killed a friend. Oh, okay. That would have been funny. Well, in hindsight. Maybe it's not at the time. Thank you very much, fans. So, first thing about being a bloke? No periods. No periods. Oh. <laughs> well, the women all hate you. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good answer. Thank you. Let's get some more fellas shouting out. Best thing about being a bloke? Having a beard. Having a beard. Having it. Uh, is that laziness or do you like the way it looks? Feels. Feels. You like the way it feels? Do you just sit at home and just. Oh. He's lying. I don't like I the way it feels. I love his beard. I don't like the way it feels. I like the way it looks, though. Yeah. It does, like. When it gets, like, too long, it's, like. It itches, like, all the time. But I got him beard conditioner so he'd shave it less and it's working. Yeah. Um, that's not what she calls it, though. <laughs> but we're not going to say it, okay? Just yeah, okay. Uh, okay. I do this when I'm driving. And so, you know, people pick their nose when they're at traffic lights. I do what I call feeling for beard. So I do that. <laughs> feeling for beard. Fuck, I've got one, I've got one. <laughs> Let's get some more fellas shouting out. Best thing about being a bloke? Grinder. Grinder. Oh, there was one clap. You might have found a mate. <laughs> Do you want to explain to those who don't know? You know what grinder is, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I actually found out what it was from uh, Dave Chappelle. Oh, really? Because he said a grinder joke, and I'm like, what's that? So I looked it up, and I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> what grinder is? Where you can find a gay man, is that right? Excellent. Okay. And it's good that there was one other clap though, isn't it? I feel like you might have found somebody tonight. <laughs> but chances are you probably already knew where he was and had sussed about and decided you didn't fucking like him. <laughs> we've got, we've got more for the blogs. We need another one from the ladies. Best thing about being a woman? Multiple orgasms. Multiple orgasms. Oh, multiple orgasms. Multiple, yeah. It's a small pocket of women are clapping and, and some of the men are going, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Do you mean like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday? <laughs> January, February, March. 2009, 2010. Multiple orgasms. Oh, you talk now. Let's work out whether I'm more male or more female. This is ever so slightly terrifying. Uh, always being right, I don't think that applies to me. Free dinners, fuck no, I've got self-respect. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> tits, I'm with you all the way, love, so I'm going to tick tits. <laughs> Sounds good, I like that. Tick tits. <laughs> I don't think we're better at everything. Not having a vagina, well, I do, so I can't tick that one. And reverse parking. Sometimes I get it in first time and I'm genuinely surprised when that happens. <laughs> Nobody more surprised than me. I just pull in and go, oh, it worked. <laughs> so I can't take that one. And I, you, I you relate to that? <laughs> yeah. You relate to that? Oh, man. You're funny, babe. First time and I'm genuinely surprised when that happens. <laughs> Nobody more surprised than me. I just pull in and go, oh, it worked. <laughs> So I can't take that one, and I, I can't take no periods, I clearly can't, I don't mean clearly, oh, uh, I mean I have periods, but it's not, is it? No. If I walk ahead, will you check the back of my skirt? <laughs> and yeah, not of a lower cousin. <laughs> Two. Uh, I can now piss through a letterbox, awesome. Watching football, I'm not really interested in football, so that doesn't apply to me. And Grinder wouldn't really help me an awful lot, I don't think. <laughs> a beard, I'm going to take that as well. If I, it's like a part time job, keeping on top of mine. You're laughing, but it's my life. So I am one, two parts woman, and oh no, two parts man. I feel like I should show you at least a bollock. <laughs> I tell you my favourite answers. Uh, my favourite girl answer, she wasn't even a woman, she was a girl, she was 16. And she said, the best thing about being a woman, she said, we can look at boobs whenever we like. It's a good answer. Well, she said, well, you know, men have to earn the right to look at your boobs. I thought she seemed awfully young to know about such things. I said, give us an example of something a man would have to do to earn the right to look at your boobs. And she quite simply said, 
they have to be nice. Aww. And it was a lovely moment, but loads of the women in the room went, Oh my God, she's right. <laughs> <laughs> We've been showing our boobs to bad men for years. <laughs> my favourite male answer is... I killed you. <laughs> You're done. That was very accurate. Uh. We've been showing our boobs to bad men for years. My favourite male answer is the man said, The best thing about being a man is dicking things. Just like dicking things? I had this explained to me, I didn't know what it was. Dicking things is the act of hitting things with your dick. No, it's just so fun. <laughs> you want to play baseball? <laughs> I can only imagine, like, there's there's probably, like, dudes out there that are like that, though. Oh. What? <laughs> I want to dick, dick things. You want to dick things? Oh, my God. I want to knock things over. <laughs> This might be the best video we've ever done. <laughs> okay? Uh. Two days after I met him, I met a lovely lady and she said, Do you remember the man who said dick and things? And I said, Yes. She said, Well, he's my fiance. I said, Did you know about the dick and things? No. <laughs> she said she'd have to go over all the surfaces with a flashlight. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no. Hello, it's Sarah Milliken. Oh man, oh, Sarah Milliken. I think that was by far the best <laughs> video I've seen of her. I like that a lot. You love that one. That oh, might have been gosh. your favorite yeah, video you've ever seen. Funny. Yeah. yeah. That's probably your favorite video yeah, you've that ever was seen. Really funny. That was really good. <laughs> we'll put that in the top five. Uh, videos I've watched Did on this channel. Did someone recommend that? Yeah. 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 It's recommended been recommended. I, Thank you. I don't, so funny. I don't remember who, but it, it's multiple people who have yeah. um, recommended that one. And they recommended that you watch it for me. Oh, yeah. I've been saving this one for like oh. a week or two for you. Yeah. That was funny. It was, um, it was really good. Sarah Milliken. But it's, it's, She's so relaxed, like, uh, yeah. the interaction with the crowd, and yeah. then when they say something, she has a, uh, a quick, uh, response. Yeah, she's quick. To give to it. Yeah. Ugh. But those, yeah, those, uh, <laughs> that reverse parking thing. Oh you, my god, that made me mad. So, you were so <laughs> mad at that. Because that uh, was such a good answer, though, too. Yeah. That was really funny. And not to, like, give them to the stereotype that girls are bad drivers, but I can't park. I'm aware. Yeah, it's hard. I'm aware, but oh. I, I don't give you a lot of shit for it. I just no, don't, don't. I just don't let you drive. Yeah, <laughs> we're when we're in the same vehicle. That's all. Wait until Greece. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll drive, drive us it. around all the no, mountains. No, no, no. We're gonna, you're gonna drive us off the mountains. <laughs> Probably. Probably. Uh, well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. We certainly did. That yeah. was one of the best videos I've ever seen on the channel. Definitely that top five. That would be a really fun stand up to go to. Yes. So yes, it would. Fun. Um, but yeah. So if you guys have been waiting for me to do Sarah Milliken, I wanted to wait to do <laughs> this happy, one with her. I'm happy he did. Because I almost did it one day, and I was like, you know what? This it's it's the title's Men versus Women, so yeah. I gotta I gotta have her on for it. So yeah, that was funny. Yeah. All right, you guys, like, subscribe, do whatever you Thank want. Thank you. I'm King Thanks Boomer. That's Queen Boomer, and we'll see you again soon. Peace out, guys. Bye.